Hello there and welcome back to Stray. Now last time we were amazed by the cat physics. At least I was, I hope you were. The game looks absolutely amazing, like stunning as well. We we're amazed at all of that. But gameplay wise, we ended up getting, we were traveling with our family, our cat family, and we ended up slipping down into the Undercity losing contact with our family itself i think they've moved on and obviously we, i need to catch up but i'm taking a different route found the well found a little settlement but on the way there we did come across the beginning with it's an alien kind of creature kind of little not exactly bugs but it's hard to describe them kind of like alien rat things weird alien rat things there's a bit an infestation basically down there who were trying to end us managed to escape from them and found a like a little robot village kind of thing found b12 our little robot pal who's helping us speak to the residents of this little village did a bit of exploring found out that there was four robot people who were trying to leave the city or leave that part of the city and get further up oh, I think I think they're going up three of them escaped one of them was left behind the one that I left behind well now currently we're going to be helping them we have a transmitter that we need to take to the top of a tower build it's kind of a building tower thing on the roof of the thing we need to head there put the things so we can have actually have contact with the people who escaped or well, attempt to anyway so that's what we're going to be doing this episode where we left it off i was about to go through the window and head towards the tower we'll have everything we need so grab your favorite drinks and snacks Get yourself comfortable and let's dive back into Stray. Enjoy, guys. Enjoy. Are we good? Let's just move that out the way because I've realized me thing. Ah, there he is. Hello. Play with the ball. Let's just ruin your rug. I don't know why I would do this, but I feel the need to ruin your rug. Sorry, my dude. Uh, okay, Momo. I'm off. I'll catch you later. I think we're done in there. Uh, shit, where am I going? Oh, he shut the window on us. Oh. Let's ride the bucket. Ride the bucket. Yes, we're heading to that tower over there. Ooh, okay, uh, can't get it. Oh, up there. Yeah, this game's so like freaking intuitive. Like it feels. Those are those little fucking mite fuckers over there. We could be in trouble here because I think we're going to be having to go past them. Ooh. Uh, why did I do that? Excuse me, why did I do that? Oh, okay. That kind of makes sense. They kind of look like head crabs. Like the Half Life head crabs. I'm very interested to work out or find out who they actually are. At least we know we can lure them with. Uh, we can lure them with a meow. Oh no, thank you. I don't like that. No, got the. Uh, ow! Get off my head! Shit! Go 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 go! Do not murk me! I don't like it. 
Hope we get get up there. That was me like being a little bit dim and uh, I was me being a little bit dim and spending too much time talking. Um, right, where we're we going? Remember. Oh, remember it? Oh, that a that a memory. Oh, wow, we're collecting memories as well, aren't we? The city is full of neon. It wasn't always this way. There used to be strict energy caps, especially in the slums. People couldn't handle the constant darkness. One day, someone lit up rainbow lamps, neon signs all over the house. That person was taken away and never seen again. But well, people saw hope, and not long after, everyone started putting lots of lights in their homes. There was nothing the oppressors could do. It was a way for people to see colours again, like on the outside. I think it helped. It does, actually. If you're in complete darkness, like, for most of your life, then it's, like, probably a whole load of shit. Like, everyone needs colour in their life. And I actually don't know where I'm going. Oh, I'm going... Okay, uh, up there. Now what? Oh, actually, if I jump from here, well, I... All right, I think I get it. I think I get it. That felt like it was gonna go the journey, right? Um. Oh, okay, I get it. So if I push this across here, We're not going to fall off because of the... Yes, we're not going to fall off. Whoa! That was a little bit too close for comfort, that one. And this feels like a whole load of bullshit. This feels like a bad spot to be in. We need to leave this spot right now. Go. Yeah, something's definitely taken over the slum. That's the one we need to be up as well. Hack the door, please. Uh oh. Um, that's a no, thank you. with the can't get us. That's a good thing. I was going to hack the door and trap them in there. I'm hoping they're not going to get through that gate. I don't know why I opened that shutter door on the other side. Why did I open the gate on the other side? Yeah, I'm not liking the the buggy bullshit. B B12, are you all right? Are you hanging out in there? He's hanging up in my little backpack. Um. Ah, there we go. There we go. Push that in there and let's get in here. Well, this looks room looks fucking tasty. Yeah, I don't like this. This is not a nice place to be. Right, so we we'll have a whole load of bullshit. Um, I don't know where we're actually supposed to be going. No, nope. alright. So they can't get to where I am right now.
Oh, 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 no, no, no. You can't, you're not gonna get me. You, you're not gonna fucking get me. Get up there. Oh, oh. I didn't think they could fucking climb up there. That was fucking scary. Right, so we need to lure them this way. Come on, over here. Everybody, oh, oh no, thank you. Okay, let's go. Let's just leave. I think there's going to be some bullshit up here. I genuinely believe that. Um, let's get up here for now, where they can't reach. So we've got a whole load... Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. I need to lure them. I'm going to check over this thing first. This is glowy. Glowy things usually mean collectible. Nico Corporation. Nico Corp. They were responsible for waste management. As trash from the upper levels overloaded the slums, they tried to develop a bacteria to dissolve it all. After the humans disappeared, that bacteria mutated, growing, eating away more than trash. So this is what this is. They're not aliens, and now we have Zerks. Let's go. So the Zerks are weaponized. Well, to become sentient, I would say. Uh, right, so the plan is... We need to hack this gate, and we need to lure them into that area on the other side of this fence. That's the plan. Whether that happens or remains to be seen. Go. Go, 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 go. Ah, bitch. Is that all of you? You know, I think that's all of them. Nice. I like it when a plan comes together. Um, right, so we need to go... In here, we need to push this this way. Now we can climb up there, climb up onto that, onto that one, straight up there. Right, so we have Zerks over that way. No way to lure, nowhere to lure them. I don't know why this feels so fucking intuitive. Like, you look at it, I don't know whether it's just me, like, I look at, I looked at that and I knew instantly what to do. I don't know whether that's mark of a good, like, game, isn't it? Where kind of, like, it looks cool, but it's kind of obvious what you need to do. It just kind of becomes instinct. Do we have Zerks here? No idea what this does. There's probably not some good. There's probably bad things are going to happen. Oh, the lift. All right. I'll accept that. Oh, okay. Uh. I need to find somewhere to hide, or I'm just. Are we just running? Oh no, thank you. You're way too close. You guys are way too fucking close. Uh, well, we're not going down. We're just going to run around in a big circle. What? The game crashed. You fucker. Right. 
I'm actually all right. It's brought us back into a good spot. All right, we're okay. We're back. We are. We're back. I don't know what the hell caused that crash, but we are back. So now we just need to wait. And we're gonna go around in a big circle. Run. We're just gonna run around in a big circle like we were last time. Oh, get off, get off, get off, get off. That backfired just very slightly. the elevator please uh shit we're bringing them up they are like little freaking head crabs b12 what the hell have you got us into that's a canny view shit that's the slums Uh, let's go that way. Let's not go. Okay, I think we're safe up here. I think we are. Here it is. Put the transceiver on this antenna. Uh, Use the item, please. Shit, see that fucking wall? Is that like the next level up? That's fucking cool. So that, like, bit in the middle of the screen now... That's the lift that leads up to the next part of town. These have helped out with Buddy. They helped out more more. Look, the view is beautiful from here. It is actually. I remember now the city. It was meant to be a shelter. A shelter from what though? Those look like stars, but they're only lights marking the hermetic roof seeing off the city. Human can built a shell to protect themselves from the outside, but it came at a cost. Nobody can go out. What's out there? What is out there? That's what I'm wondering now. The outside was a disaster, completely barren, unlivable and dangerous. Where did the goal? If you come from there, it must mean it's safe again. My promise wasn't just to go to the outside, it was to open the city. Okay, so the outside must be okay because we were... I, I forgot we were up a height when there was greenery. So it can't be unbarren, like barren. Alright. I completely forgot about that until just you mentioned it. I didn't realise we came from like the very top and then we slid down. I slid down to the bottom. Sorry, I still don't understand why some memories are coming back and others aren't. But I'm certain now this is my purpose. I have to open the city. Come on, let's go back and find more. more. Now that we've connected the transmitter, we should be able to get help. Okay, uh, are we going back to... Bowhouse and all that shit this time. I like it. I truly love this game. Like, I don't know what it is about it, but I'm very intrigued, and just, I like the character. I like, I like the main character. I just like the fact that it's a, a cat. A uh, ball. Oh. Um, one more. Oh, 
Look, a note. Little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of their antenna. Come meet me there. I've locked the window, but the code to open it is quite simple. It is... I ain't reading that. <laughs> Be careful, it is case sensitive. See you at the bar, more more. That must be the code for the window near the entrance. Thank you, B12, for taking a photo of that. Which I'm sure you're going to do for us, because you're the one who's opening this door, because I don't have any opposable thumbs. Here's the lock for the window. The code was... Don't, don't mess. Don't mess. Okay, thank you. Mum was at the bar waiting for us. Alright, let's go to the bar then. I don't know where the bar is, but let's go to the bar. Uh, oh, it was down on the ground, wasn't it? So let's head down, head, head down to the ground floor. I'm going to sneeze. <coughs> it's becoming a thing. Every time I record... I have to sneeze or cough at some point. Uh, let's jump down. Can we get like all the way down? I don't even know where the bar is. Uh, translate. Translate. Bartman Super Spirit Laundry Grandma Clothing Elliot Programming. Would Super Spirit be the bar? <laughs> Announcement. I'm looking for any sheet music to play the guitar and add some ambience. If you find any, bring them back to me. I live near the elevator at Morusk. Oh, I actually have some. Hello? Hello? Hi. Are you okay, dude? Kind of just standing there looking a bit creepy. Ooh, memory. Nice. What, what we're remembering here? Rip hum rest in peace, humans. Humans were the first residents around here. It seems like they're all dead now. What do you think it feels like being dead? That's an age-old question, that one. I know it's silly coming from me, but are they actually at peace? Will I be at peace when I die? I don't know what death feels like for an AI. I'm sorry, didn't want to break the mood. Let's move on. It, some deep fucking questions there, dude. Some deep questions, B12. Uh, can I have something like that? Want to play with the button? I'm just exploring this thing. I don't know. I have no idea where we're supposed to be going. Uh, translate. Grandma clothing. Ooh, can we get a... Hi. I do love knitting. So far I've knitted 478 miles of scarves. It's something to do. It's a lot of scarves. If you bring some electric cable, I could make you a poncho. You inspire me. But it's not easy to find the right materials around here. Oh shit. Alright, I fucking, you know what? I want a fucking poncho. I want a poncho. Hi. Grandma made me these clothes. Pretty stylish, no? They are actually very cool. Uh, hi. Go up. You want something? Uh, no. I need to find the guy with the. So he's near the elevator, wasn't he? Oh, hi, Momo. Hi. Oh, found the bar, at least. Come here, I managed to get a signal. Uh, I'm in the middle of something else. Uh, hang out there with... Hang out there for a second, will you? Um, I'm on a mission for a poncho. 
What's down here? Oh, hello. Uh, I'm the merchant of the market. You give me something, I'll give you something in exchange. It's as simple as that. Set of electric and best on the market. I exchange it for a super spirit detergent. All right. What's that? This is an ancient relic, a testament to the talent of our ancestors. It will cost you three energy drink cans. I can't do less. Oh, you know what? I have two. Let's find us a third energy drink. I have two already, so there's got to be a third one around, and I mustn't be able to use the same machine. And I need to find some detergent. So we need the laundry. Super spirit laundry. So we need to be... I guess the feeling that the laundry is where we are going to find our detergent. Hi. Those guys better not drop paint bucket again or else Cosmo will be ticked off. Alright. Super spirit laundry. Hi. Let me in, please. Are you one of the troublemakers playing with the paint buckets on the roof? No. Keep your paint away. I'm tired of cleaning my stoop because of your mess. Oh, I, okay. I get it. I get it. And uh, let's just head up here. Nice and quick like. Um, how are we getting up? How are we getting up from here? Alright, get this, this can we get up this side? There we go. We are up this side. Are you the empties? I need to Meow. Thank you. Distracted. Now you're going to come out, clean up your paint. Now I can sneak in and get some detergent. Then, chain reaction. We're doing a chain reaction, guys. We're doing a chain reaction. Sorry. Uh, actually, I need to find a fast way now. <laughs> I don't know if it's on a timer. Excuse me. Um. What do you want? Detergent, didn't it? Oh, there we go. Um. Super Spirit Detergent. Thank you. Is there anything else in here that we want to have a look at? No, we don't, go, we don't want to go in there. Cats do not belong inside washing machines, no matter what anyone may say. Um, goodbye. Now I need to remember where the heck he was. Oh, I would need... Because I want the other thing, the artifact. I need to find another vendor machine. Got to find a third vendor machine. Help. Uh, I'm not interested in Momo right now. Oh, hello. There we go, there's, there's a vendor machine. Thank you. Give me the drink. 
Nice. So we have everything we need. Now we just need to get back down to the street. Can we get down here? Uh, yoik and yoik. Let's go find our buddy. Or part of buddy. He was down here, wasn't he? That didn't take as long as I was expected. It took a while, but it wasn't, you know, what I expected. Um, inspect that. Hello again, what do you want now? This is an ancient relic, a testament to the talent of our ancestors. Cost you three any drinks, I can't do this. Uh, here you go. Oh, it's a memory. Alright. Modern floor. This is an early model of a companion. Back then they didn't have any personality. They were just glorified autonomous cleaners. I think it's nice that eventually mimicked humans. It's like they missed them in a way that kind of kept them from going extinct. They're good robots. I'm a little bit disappointed in it just being a memory, but that's not why we actually came here. We actually came here for electric cable. Yes. I exchange this for a super spirit detergent. That's the best I can do. Well, as it happens, I have a super spirit detergent right here. Alright. We have the cable. Thank you. Let's go see Granny. I don't remember where Granny is, but we're going to find Granny. Uh, music guy. Granny was down here, wasn't it? Uh, Granny's Crawthorn's the third one, wasn't it? Yes. So it's down here. There she is. There she is, Granny! Granny! Hello, little one. Do you have any electric cable for me? I'd love to make a poncho for you, but I need that cable. Um. Yes, I have the cable. Are we getting a poncho? This poncho. Are we getting a poncho? Gain new item. There you go, little one. That'll suit you well. Thank you. Uh, can I put it on? How do I put it on? This is really warm, perfect for a cold robot. Can I wear it? Damn it. Can I not wear it myself? Can I, is it not a cat poncho? I'm a little bit disappointed. Does that mean there's a cold robot somewhere to give it to? Alright, so you don't need it. Uh... And she's still going to be mad. She's still mad. Uh, are you alright? I think she'd still be mad. Right. Uh, what does he want for this music sheet? Does he want a poncho for this music sheet? Aye. What do you want for that? One energy drink can, alright. That I can't deal with right now. Let's not bother with it. Uh, right, we are going to the bar. Let's go to the bar. Let's actually continue the main story. A little side tangent with some side quests. Hello. Hi, Momo. It's too damn cute. Let me see if I can get this thing working. You got a signal. 
Oh, hello, that's a face. That's a face. I've almost got it. Hello, can anyone hear me? Hello, yes, we can hear you. You're from the slums. We're looking for a way out. And wait, is that you, Zabatar? Momo. I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice, Zabatar. Where are you? Where are the others okay? Yes, we are safe. We found a way up. Hello? Do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers to reach us. Oh shit. Very dangerous. Zerks everywhere. Sewers? How? Hello? Darn it. We've lost the signal. Can't believe it. Zabatar is alive and the other outsiders managed to go up through the sewers. The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums because Zabatar made it. There must be a way. How are we going to get in there? Hi. You'll never get past the sewers. It's infested with Zerks. They'll make a quick meal out of you. Especially you, little one. They've, they've tried in the past. They've tried in the past. Many tried their luck in the past. It doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you. Your business is none of my business. Jacob. Hmm, Seamus. His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, I think I read about that. A few years ago, he went off to test his device and never came back. Seamus has never been the same since. You know what, Momo? I like your fucking style, to be fair. I like the robe and I like the hat. Don't listen to Seamus, he's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he's working on it. There might be a clue in Shame's apartment. Now, come come on, follow me. Alright. I guess we're going for... I guess we're going for a walk. Baby. B12, hang on here. Uh... Let's just go for a walk. How long are we going to take? Because you're not like moving very fast. Right, straight through the paint. I'm a little disappointed that he's not leaving footprints. However, I do understand why he's not re leaving footprints. Because there's no guarantee. Go on, Seamus. Open the door. You know your father would have wanted to help us. Am I, like, sneaking in? Well, that was to be expected. This situation is pretty tough on Seamus. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me. But you? I think I have an idea. All right, Momo. You do your thing. Oh, I thought I was going up through a window. Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. It contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as an electroshock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back up to the bar to try and re-establish communication with the others. Alright, uh, let's go and sneak in. Hi, Seamus. Hello. What are you doing here? I told you. Getting through the sewers is a suicide mission. Leave me be. Um. What's this? Wait, is this my papa's? Oh wow, I never knew. There's a secret room here in our flat, but where? Right, so we are look are we looking for secret? So I just destroyed you. I destroy every. Just destroy everything on the top. Translate that. Time will tell. Get off the walls. B 
it time will tell clock maybe I was gonna destroy your whole freaking apartment just in case something hidden by <laughs> oh hello time will tell hold on 16 we've got to go off the the hands see all those crocs there so it'll be our hands because all the top ones are 16 so that'll be what two five one one twenty five eleven Two, five, one, one. Oh, that fucking good. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't exactly hard, but, you know, I'm pleased with myself, all the less. Or nonetheless. If there is indeed a weapon capable of dealing with Zerks, there must be some sign of it around here. Let's search the whole flat. Uh, we've been in here before. Oh shit, we have Zerks inside the shit. What's this? Observations. Cute sounds, but never friendly. All bacteria of human time. Eat all kinds of materials. Total vision in the dark. React to, the in react to intense light. It don't, actually, I forgot it does. I should eat. You know when I was running around... So I didn't, you know, I read that to myself and I didn't actually read it to you guys. I'm hoping that you read it. Uh, what's this? Robots news headlines. Zerk are officially no longer under control. They now eat metal. I'm not keen on these Zerks being here. Uh, is that the plans? Deflux the blueprint. Concept light based handgun, low priority visual appearance, size, decibel emitted. High priority test in real condition. Objective 20 Zerk destroyed per second. Damn, that's a lot of fucking. Uh, Seamus? Find anything interesting in here? Can we go up there? Nope, nothing in there. Uh, wait, do we have another one? Do we have more shit to that we can? Oh, something up here. Is something in here? Broken tracker. Oh, okay. Seamus. Hi, my dude. Uh, yes, I found a broken tracker. Maybe we can track down... Track down, obviously, the, the weapon. Obviously, his dad as well. Because obviously, his dad has the weapon. Wait, I remember that. That's his tracker. I've always used that tracker to keep an eye on where, he, where I was. Maybe you can reverse it to find where he went. I can't believe my papa might still be alive. I've missed him so much. I get the feeling he might not be. You need a weapon from the Zerk. For, for the Zerks, right? My pup definitely took one with him. We just need to repair the tracker so we can find him. Someone in the slums should be able to help. Come with me. I'll open the door for you. Don't walk on me. Right, so we need to find the track. We need to repair this tracker. Then go down and grab the weapon. Hi. Uh, do we want to go see Momo? Maybe he knows who to how to repair it. There's no repair thing, was there? What I'm in Oh Elliot programming. Maybe. Are we gonna try and find Elliot? Is that like the 
good idea. Unless we want to see more more first. Hi. Wait, I passed it. Elliot programming to the right. Not in here. Go see Momo. So you might have a clue as to... Hi. She does. It's a nice girl. Uh, hello, buddy. Hello, Momo. Um, I'm really struggling to get the connection back. Did you find anything interesting at Seamus's? Interesting device. It looks broken. Maybe someone in the village can help you repair it. Did you ask at the bar? Uh, I'm asking you. I'm asking you at the bar. Uh, no. Get down. Hi. Are you... Are you... Can you repair something? A tracker? I don't know how to get that fixed. Bartender might have some ideas. Alright. Thank you for the bartender. Jacob, employ the... Sanctuary. Can you help? You're around here. What can I do for you? Um, sure. What a beautiful object and rare too. An old guy who fixes stuff like this. He's very talented. Just a little. Well, you'll see. His name's Elliot. His office just left of here near Grandma's shop. There are signs all over his door. Oh, okay. So it was in the right area. Hi. Right. Um, no, but can you decipher this? Maybe. It's very old binary code you have here. Only real geek can read this. And nothing on the poncho. Alright then. Do fur bar. That 101 screams at me every time. Uh, right, so Grandma's shop. Signs all over his door. That oh hello. That's the one. Hi. Le knock knock. Let me in please. Hi. Hello. Hi, can I can I meet you please? Uh, excuse me. Ex I was trying to meet you but you locked us out. Excuse me. Hello. Never mind. Um, I'm just going to ignore that then. We were programmed to be slaves, but since... Number. Long number. Here's we have a soul. Some day, hope one day outside we'll find the exit of this hell. One more. Hello. How? Oh, we can meet you now. Hi. You here for Elliot? He's just over there. Thank you. Elliot! Are you upstairs? I think you might be upstairs. Oh, hello. Oh, a memory. Let's remember that right now, just because we can. That would be a tree, though. Shit. This tree is a scientific marvel. It's remarkable that human ingenuity found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Organic life requires trees to purify the city's air. Robots don't need it, but they take care of them anyway. It's what the humans would have wanted. We've got a canny few of the like, lesser memories. Oh, right, sorry, I'm getting distracted. I'm getting distracted by like looking for shit. Hi. Hello, Elliot. Yes, can I help you? Uh, yes, you can. Oh, wow, that's a great tracker. I recognise this model. It's a Tohima BR2000. You can track anyone with this little gadget. May I? I know how to repair it, but when I'm trembling at it, I can't use my keyboard. I don't know if I'm sick or something, but I definitely don't feel right. I can't work when I'm shivering at it. So I think I need a blanket. Fucking pay off. Sorry. <laughs> In the hunt for my... <laughs> 
sake. I'm sorry, that, that just boggled my mind there for a second. In the hunt for getting myself a new outfit, the poncho, I have accidentally pre-done an op a thing that I need. Uh, would you like this poncho? <laughs> oh, where did you find this? It's amazing. Let me try it on. I like it when shit like that happens. You, you pre-do a quest before, you know, pre-do stuff in a quest. Look, no tremors. I'm able to work again. Thanks, now I can definitely fix your tracker. Let me take a look. Just gotta give it an update and one more thing. Voila. Thank you. There you go, little one. Good luck finding who you're looking for. Thank you. Uh, right, are we going back to... We taking a shortcut out. Oh, we are. Uh, down there. Down here. Um. Are we going back to Seamus? Are we going back to Momo? Seamus. Uh, shit. Where was Seamus again? That's the. Okay, V12. Tell me where am I going? Now that we fix that tracker, let's find Seamus track down his papa. Alright. Um, I don't remember. Do we have a map? I don't think we have a map. And I can't remember where we went. Uh, No, we, ah, it was this way. This is the way we went, because we went through here, because I remember talking about the paint. Seamus! My dude! Did you manage to fix that tracker? Yes, I fucking did. You did it. You fixed it. Well done. Give it here. We track him. We got a ping. Is Papa really loud? I can't believe it. Let's follow the tracker. Maybe we'll find where my Papa went. All right, am I following you? All right, I guess we're following you. Do a little bit of vocalization. Well, I think we're going to the sewers. What the heck was that noise? Where we're we going, dude? I can't believe I pre pre did the fucking poncho. I can't believe I redid, pre-did that. I was hoping for a outfit for myself because it said it was, you know, a poncho for me. Ooh, hello. Uh, is this where we're going? This must be it. He really left the slums. It's dangerous out there, but I must be sure. I need to know. Let's do this. Okay. Are we going? Oh, there's a lot of bad shit in here. That looks not very nice. Nice and bright though. But we have creepy shit. Shamus, are you coming in or not? Oh, there you are. Alright. I was fucking worried there that you just, like, abandoned us.
Look at all these Zerk eggs. They will eat us. I can't do this. I'm not as fast as you. The Zerks will get me for sure. Here, take this badge. My papa will recognise it. He will know that you're a friend. Giving you an outside badge. Cool. I'll open the door for you. Oh, it actually appears on me backpack. That's cool. Okay. Hold on a second. Anything up here? No. Nothing up there. Alright. You hang out. I'll be fine. Hopefully. Uh, can we go up on there? Can I walk up, up there? No. We've got some standing water. Let's get up a height. Just a second while I have a bit of a scout. Oh, memory. That would be a memory. Uh, what will remember in here? Look how huge this wall is. Oh, it's the wall itself. I remember it was a similar division between those in the slums and Midtown. That and the fact that they kept throwing their garbage down here. What a horrible thing to do. Maybe that's why they failed. I do kind of feel the need to platinum this game. Or like, you know, get all the achievements. I may do that on my own time. Focus on story. Oh, dead end. That's just a little bit creepy shit. Alright, so I guess we're not going back up. Fuck it, we're running. Okay, we're just we're just gonna run for it. We're just gonna run for it. Get off me. I get go 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 missed me bitch I don't know if I'm going bring around the rosies fuck you oh no 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 I got cocky I'm sorry I didn't mean to say fuck you Are we being actively chased anymore? No, we're not. That'll do me. Uh, oh, wait. I need to jump there. And then I need to jump back on so I can push it the other way. Go! Go! Okay, there we go. That's the one. Wasn't quite in the right spot. But that seems like a vehicle. Oh, oh shit. All right, so I guess we're going for a ride. I'm not in control. Oh. Get up! Get up! Get up, Mr. Tinkles! Are you okay? That was a huge fall. Doc should be nearby. We must be close. That was a kind of fucking trip. If Zerks come now, we are completely buggered. Are we alright? Okay, we'll lick, we'll lick down ourselves to health. So we're back in the walls. This shit, there's bullshit up there. Uh, let's go that way. Let's not go up there. Let's go this way. Doc? Hello? Please see you nearby and that you're okay. That looks like a whole load of old shit in there. Can I get up there? No.
Right, where the fuck are the Zerks? I get the feeling the Zerks are going to be coming. Right, so we have a use item. I don't think I've got an item to use in there. Mr. Ute, shove a bit of paper in there. Hmm, it's an extra generator, but it seems to require some other part to function. Maybe a fuse. What's that up there? Oh, I just thought I was something landing on top of that bag. So let's follow the wire. See where the wire leads. It's generated to power something. Let's not knock those over. This is quite fucking bright. Yoink and yoink. leads in here. I'm not going to go in there yet because I think if I go in there we're going to end up being lost. or not trapped. When you're trapped and I'm going to end up missing whatever's out here. What's potentially out here. It kind of makes sense that it would lead us to the actually it doesn't make sense that it would lead us there but sorry I'm you know when you like, lose track of your thoughts you think something and it doesn't kind of make sense so you try and backtrack and then it equally doesn't make sense I was wondering you know I was going to say it's obvious that you know it would lead us to the item that we need for the generator but that's not obvious. It's it's not actually the case, is it? All right. So this. So this is being powered. Oh, this is going to be powered. Little zerks. And then that leads back to the way we came. Can we go downstairs. What's downstairs? Oh, hello. Are you Doc? Hi. It is Doc. Shit, he's alive. Whoa. Wait, you're not a Zerk. Who are you? That's my badge you're wearing. How did you find it? Did my son send you? Oh, Seamus, you clever boy. I've been alone here for ages. I came here to test my defluxer, but it didn't go as planned. Wish I could go back home. I miss my son dearly. You can have a look around the house if you want, but I have no idea how to escape this place. Alright. Let's grab that memory for a start. What do you remember about this? I've seen humans wear costumes like this. They were small and running around making lots of noise. Kids. I guess I remember now, they were children. The streets felt much more alive with them. Even with the difficulty they brought, the adults seemed to love them very much. Doc says he misses Seamus. Is that the same thing? Yeah, I would say it's probably the same thing. Alright, uh, so what do we need? I don't know if I want to knock them over or not. Uh, I don't quite know what I'm looking for. Maybe I need to talk to... Can I get up? Hello. This, this, yeah, this is what I'm after. Hey, be careful that defluxer. At full charge, it can explode zerks like confetti. Nice. I just, so I just pre-read that. I get the riff. This baby needs 1.21 gigawatts <laughs> to work. 1.21 gigawatts. And only thing around here that kind of juices the generator outside the house. The problem is that it won't start. I think a fuse blew, and with all that the zerks around, it's too dangerous for me to go out and fix it. I, I can do that. 
I'm not fast enough, but you just might be. If you can reach the generator and replace the fuse, I should be able to get the deflux or recharged. Sorry, I was finding that funny. Go on, follow me. I'll show you what to do. I know I kind of know what to do. I need to take the fuse and I need to... Where, where did you go? Are you going upstairs? You go upstairs. You did go upstairs. Alright, this is the way I came in. Yeah, take this fuse, it's brand new. Thank you. Turning on the generator will be loud, so expect some zerks. Once you fix the generator, I should be able to charge and kickstart the deflux. You just need to follow this cable, change the fuse, and meet back here. Best of luck. Alright. Easy, man. Easy. I'm not even a little bit scared. Uh. So let's head down here. And obviously we need to head back to the generator. I don't know where they're gonna whether the where the Zerks are gonna come out. Power. Charge. Yeah, they're going to be attracted to all... Uh, they're coming out for... Okay, they're coming out of everywhere. Oh, run. Um, are you following me? There we go. Thank you. No, 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 I'm out of range, I'm out of range, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Fuck. I am very surprised I made that there. I thought I'd gone the wrong way. <laughs> Amazing! You got the generator back on. You see how powerful the defluxer is? It's definitely our way out of here. Wait a minute, I'm able to mount this defluxer to your drawer. Okay, that, that's some that's some shit. That's some shit. Do we have a weapon now? It worked. The flux was now installed in your fancy drone. There, it's not meant to run off such a small power source. If you use it too much, it could malfunction. Just remember, it's dangerous. Now let's go back to the village. I'm coming home, son. Alright. And um, how do I use it? I don't know if I should try it on there. I don't know how to... To be fair, I don't know how to use it. Oh, okay. So it's like torch mode and then left bumper sorry I mean it's probably a little bit cruel but I mean they are not very nice yo that fucking worked take out those looks so we can get through I've already done it kid I've already done it Wow, it's working great, but I suspected it can overheat. Let it cool for a bit when that happens. Hope it'll last until we reach the village. I mean, it should. Cause the breath as well. See that? Sorry, I'm just looking at the cat. See, he's breathing. Even that animation looks real. I'm seriously, like, in fucking love with this game. Like, seriously. It's fucking amazing. <laughs> it's amazing! This switch doesn't work. It looks like the electricity has been cut. Uh, can we solve that somehow? Oh, we can. Uh, let's just. Actually, where am I going? I 
I don't know where I'm supposed to be taking this thing. I'm not supposed to be taking it anyway. Hello? Must we open that door? Probably is, but I don't know. Oh! Right, so I'm moving that out of the way. And I can move this to the left now. I don't quite know how that helps me, but... Wait, I think I get it. Can I get up there and then get up? Oh, I know where I'm going. I know where I'm going. I see it, that little red thing there. The red shit with the shit. Right, so let's get out. Take your time. Um. Right, so I guess we're going down. have to hit that switch I don't quite know how that's gonna that's probably gonna cause us some major fucking issues oh okay we've got sugar does that open both doors recharge It fucking works. This thing's nice. I don't know if we're gonna upgrade it. Oh! Go! Oh, shit! No, get off my head! Okay, I don't know if I can upgrade that to make it last longer, but okay, we'll fucking dealt with it. Whew, that was close. Let's go back home. All right then, Doc, you lead the way. Lead, lead on. I'll, I'll cover you. I will fucking cover you. I don't no idea who used to live here, but oh, we we'll have a door. Does this lead back to is this lead back to the village? I think we're all right. Are we all right now? Let me out. I think, yep, we're all right. We made it. <laughs> we fucking made it. Hi. Oh, that that got me a little bit there. That's that's got me. A little, I know the robots, but that got me a little bit there. Hello, Guardian. Thanks for saving Doc, little friend. It's great to see that Seamus is no longer alone. Now we know that we can fight back against the Zerks. Momo has been waiting for you by the sewers. Alright. That'll friggin' do me. Doc and Seamus look happy. I think we did a good thing together. We did, actually. We did a very good thing. Right, sewers. Hi. Moon was waiting for you on this boat. You can join him, but have you done everything you wanted in here? Because I'll close the door behind you. Don't want any Zerks coming through. Hmm. 
I mean, it's right here. I kind of want to think it is safe. Examine. See? It's written, follows the numbers, but looks like a binary language. A succession of zeros and ones. You must be able to decipher this code one way or another. It's probably related to this safe. Well, shit, I'm a little bit disappointed. More music sheet. Do I want to finish the music quest? No, you know what? No. I'll maybe do it on another playthrough. Let's go. We will play this again and do a proper explore, but on my own time. Uh, let's go. Hello, Momo. Can I have a bit of a spy around here? I don't know what you're waiting for us, and you know, I said I want to, you know, speed it up a little bit. <laughs> Hi. It's a nice boat. Can't believe you found Doc and got the defluxer. With this, now let's we can go find Zabatar. Let's go. All right. We're we going through the sewers. Hello? Yeah, let's just turn the torch on there uh, for a second. This is a little bit creepy. I'm a little bit uncomfortable at this spot. Uh, you alright, Momo? Let's just remain on guard. The heck was that noise? I get the feeling we might be, uh, on the defensive here. Russ and Pepper's robot over there on the right hand side. You lost your head. Alright. Uh, sorry, should I talk? Should I actually, sh let's talk to him first, just make sure. Hi. I don't see any way to open this gate. Can you take a look on the other side? Uh, yes, I can. I can do that for you. I can do that for you. It's in my best interest. That is a big fucking eggs right there. I do not like the look of those. Access control system. Can't get in there. So let's head this way. It's focusing on that door. Uh, okay, can't get there. Oh, I don't like it. Get off my backside. Get off my backside. Fuck you, bitches. That backfired just a little bit, but I'm, I'm kind of glad that I attached them first. Or attacked them first. Can I get... I can't jump on here from there. Uh, go, 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 go. Get it, Momo. We made it. Let's go. 
because I get the feeling they would have popped anyway if I was if I jumped on that platform and that switch. So at least I now know as well that I can pop the eggs before. What the hell's up there? I thought it was a guy sitting up there. That's a fucking little shit with the shits. Just back up a little bit because I think they're going to jump on. They're going to jump off there and they're going to jump onto this platform onto the boat. Go on, you do you. I dare you. Jump down, I dare you. A double dog dare you. You'll be popped. You be pop pop like a fucking zit. Are we good? I get the feeling we're gonna have some run into some trouble. Also, machine is broken now. I think we know only open it manually. Well, give yourself in a good spot. Wait, are you opening? Damn! All right. Am I going through? I can't go on with you, but I won't stop looking for a way. All right. When you find Zabatar and Clementine, tell them I was brave. You were brave. Oh, shit. Uh, B. Let's just get ourselves ready just for an attack. head popping moments that actually looks like the hell does it oh it's a cover I was gonna see what the hell is that that look creepy okay are you gonna pop I'm not overly keen on that. I don't think I'll get this way. Do I want to be risky? I mean, if I get run into trouble, I can always think, I want to kind of see what's down here. Okay, I can run back. Go. Hi. Alright, that worked. I kind of want to see what's down here. Is there anything good down here? We have, do we have secret loot? Oh, memory? Memory. Right, I'll take a memory. I think this is the only thing down here. The sewer system. Yes, I remember now. Clean water was scarce. The city was supplied by a huge machinery that dug deep into the earth. Just like everything else, it was rationed out to sustain people during times of drought. The scientist showed me the blueprint of the water tanks. They are huge and could contain a whole building in them. I don't, know if this, I don't think this is one of the tanks. Well, okay, let's go. Let's go back. This is not the way we're supposed to come. However, it was a nice little secret. Little secret area. 
I'm hanging a left here because we're not going to fuck with those guys over there. And we're heading down. I'm kind of sad that we leave, left had to leave Momo behind. But I don't know how he would have gotten through. I don't know how he would have gotten through this bit. Okay. Uh, this is a lot of them. I kind of don't want to fuck with them right now. Like, I don't have to deal with them if I have to pop. Oh, they know, we're, uh, they know I'm here. This, this is a bad idea. Wait, was that it? I was expecting more. I'm not even going to complain. I'm not even going to complain. I'm was expecting more bullshit, like a lot more of them, but I'm not even going to fucking complain, let's go, let's go B. Are you seeing up behind me? Are you coming up behind me? No, we're, we're alright, we're okay. Those are fucking eyeballs. Oh shit, that's creepy as fuck. Get off, get off, get off, get off, get off, get off, get off. Get off, I'm dead, I'm dead. Fuck. Okay, let's retry. I don't know if I'm supposed to run through there. Feels like we should run. Time to leave. Uh, shit. No, 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 We got it. We got it. Right, so are we running like those eyeballs are creepy as fuck. Oh, I don't like it. We're just gonna run. We're just gonna run. We are just running. Way too many of them. Get off, get off, get off. I think it's just gonna. F Why wouldn't they just follow us? I'm not even gonna question it. We're, we're fine. I'm not even gonna question it. Kind of don't want to fuck with them. Like, I could just pop the eggs and then pop the guys and do it like a little bit at a time. But I kind of don't want to mess, like mess with them. Be a little bit stealthy about it until we absolutely have to run. All right. So I get the feeling we have to cross. Should we clear a route? Right, so when we hit that panel, 
come across here. I don't know if we have to be on if we're on a timer. And it may completely backfire because I'm you know I'm gonna try and plan where I'm going and I think all of them are probably gonna pop. And those are fucking eyeballs in there. See the eyelids? That's creepy as fuck. Uh, re ah! All right, reset. Yeah, I get the feeling that this is going to be a complete waste of time. I think these eyeballs are gonna wake up and they're gonna all hell's gonna break loose as soon as we hack this panel. Yep. Go. Go. Go 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 go. We're just going. We're just diving. I really don't fucking like those eyeballs. That's not a good time in there. Like, are these... Is there something bigger than just the bacteria? Like, Zerg bacteria? Oh, hello. Are you alive? Hi. I can't talk to him. He won't let us talk to him. Hello, eyeballs. I will scratch in your general direction. <laughs> Can I... Well, at least I know that me uh, gun thing doesn't work on them. It doesn't even like blind them. Holy fuck. That's a giant ass eyeball. We are having, we are in, we, yeah. I now know why no one goes to the sewers, and why the sewers are dangerous. B12. Don't go up, don't go up to the eyeball. B12, B12, a little help here. Thank you. Grab him, grab him. Thank you. Okay. Now it's time to run. We're just running. Time to leave. Do the zigzags. Do all the zigzags. Fuck you. Left. I don't like this at all. Uh, left. Shut the door. Left. I'm watching. I'm spanning right. Hang on right, hang on right, get off, get off me, get off me, fuck you. Oh, go, 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 go. I'm hoping that's one of our robot friends. B12. B12. Wake up. Hi. Are you alright? It was dark, I was alone. I felt like I was back in the network. Will you save me? Thank you, friend. I'm glad you're fucking alright. I don't know how I could deal with your loss. Drawing that much power was rough on my call. But the flux was completely destroyed now. We'll have to be careful. Oh, shit, alright. 
Okay. Uh, I'll tell you what, though. That is where we're going to leave it for this fucking week. Right, guys. That was... Enjoy... That was... That fucking eyeballs, all those eyeballs are freaky as fuck. So that's like, gotta be a central intelligence thing. What the hell are the... The start off as bacteria. To get rid of waste and then they've evolved into something much bigger and much, much more sinister. That's fucking scary. That, that sewer level was fucking creepy. <laughs> Managed to save B BB though, B12. But fuck me, that was creepy. I can't believe I as well that you know managed to get pre pre solve that puzzle. <laughs> so cat, we are going to leave that here for this week. I hope you're still enjoying the game as much as I am. I'm just in love with it as on my own. You know, I'm probably going to end up playing it again at some point. Just to explore a little bit more and get all the secrets and all the memories and stuff. Just hang around as a cat. Shit. That was some good shit. It's a good... This is... Re I really like this game. I'm, I'm going to say it again. Really like it. It's just got so much charm to it. It's unreal. <laughs> <coughs> so. Thank you all for watching. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, let me know in the comment section below. I want to put my tongue into gear. If you're new here, feel free to hang out. Come check out some other stuff that we have going on. We would love to have you here. If you're not new here, welcome back. Thank you again for all the support. It is much appreciated. I love you all from the bottom of my heart. And you all know what's coming. Please like, share, comment, subscribe and all that jazz. And as always, just see us on the flip side. Bye bye.